Hey there, Jackie here, and in this video, I'm going to show you how you can send your quiz takers their results via email using Flowdesk. The first thing you want to do in your Flowdesk account is create a segment for each of the quiz results that you have. So if you click on audience up here at the top and then choose segments, your segments will appear here. Today I have a quiz that tells you which face mask is best for you, and I have one more quiz result to add. So I'll click on new segment add a peel off mask, choose any segment color if you prefer and click on save. The next thing you want to do is create a workflow or an automation so that you can send these quiz takers based on the different uh, face mask they should use or quiz result that they get a different workflow or a different email or series of emails to that tell them more about their quiz result. So to do this, I'll click on workflows. And you can see here, I've already created three workflows. Again, you'll want one workflow for each quiz result. And so let's add the fourth workflow for the peel off mask. I'll click on new workflow. You can choose either start from scratch or choose a template for a sequence. I'll use this one. Customize it to your liking or build it out if you're starting it from scratch. And then you'll want to add a trigger. So the workflow will begin with a subscriber being added to a segment. And the segment that we want to choose is for peel off mask. Once that's set up and the sequence is to your liking, simply click publish. Next, you will log into your Interact account so we can complete the integration. Find the quiz that you're setting up and click on edit. And over to the left, turn on lead generation. Here's where you're going to set up your quiz opt-in form. You can change the text to your liking. And once that's ready to go, click on save and continue. Now we're going to choose Flowdesk from this list of integrations. And you'll see that this does require Zapier or a third party integration. So we'll simply click connect to Zapier. And now we will head over to your Zapier account so that we can build out this Zap. In your Zapier account, click on Create Zap. And we're going to start with a trigger, which is when someone completes your Interact quiz or subscribes to your quiz. So in this search field, we'll look for the Interact app and click it. We'll choose an event, which is a new lead. Hit Continue. And then choose your Interact account. Hit continue, and then choose the quiz that you are wanting to set this up for and hit continue. You can hit test trigger and this is going to pull a sample or a test account for you. As long as it found a lead, go ahead and click continue. And now we will add an action. So when someone subscribes, a new lead subscribes to your Interact quiz, we wanna send them over to Flowdesk. So in this action step, we'll find Flowdesk and we will create a new subscriber. Hit continue. And then you're going to want to add your Flowdesk account. So if you don't have this set up already, it'll just ask you to fill in your Flowdesk login and password. Once that's set, hit continue. And the action here, we're gonna to wanna to set up for one specific result at a time. So in the segment, let's start with peel off mask. And then we're going to want to collect their email. So that will pull from the email field on the Interact Quiz opt-in form. And we're also collecting their first name. So we'll pull this from the first name field on the Interact opt-in form. Hit continue. And before we actually test this action, we're going to want to scroll up a little bit and in between the trigger and the action, we want to add a filter because we don't want every new lead coming from this quiz to be tagged with peel off mask or added to the peel off mask segment. We want to make a filter that only sends people who got the peel off mask quiz result into that, that appropriate segment. So I'll add a filter right here. And I will say choose field. So only if the tag or the interact quiz result contains peel off mask, should this zap continue. Now we can jump down to the last action step and test this out. You can see a subscriber was sent to Flowdesk. So if you open Flowdesk, head over to your audience, you'll see this test lead 
and that they were tagged with the segment peel off mask or the quiz result that you want to give them. Go ahead and set up the zap for each of your quiz results. So you'll have one zap per result that you have so that you can filter just that one result to the specific segment you want someone to get. The last thing you want to do is head back to your Interact account and from the integration page, click Activate Connection. From here, you can test the integration or publish your quiz and test it out live. And that is how you can email your subscribers in Flowdesk the quiz result that they get right away. Remember, if you still need a quiz or are still trying to complete yours, head over to ai.tryinteract.com and have a quiz built for you.